In my uh, latest project I'm working on here is a simple do-it-yourself data logger. And I used to work in the bike industry as a designer, so I'm building this for uh, mountain bike suspension design testing. And this is something that's really super easy to build using off-the-shelf components. You know, anyone who can use a soldering iron can, can build this. And how it works, it has a spark core, which is a Wi-Fi uh, microcontroller. And that's uh, powered by a lithium polymer battery here, a single cell, with has a little battery monitoring circuit, um, a little uh, charge circuit here over USB, and that outputs power to a 5-volt uh, regulator, boost regulator. So it ups the voltage from 3.7 to 5 volts. And then uh, your code is uploaded to this through the uh, Wi-Fi connection. Uh, so when I have it installed on the bike in this nice little weatherproof enclosure, I don't have to take it out to upload the code. So it makes it really quick and easy. And then it reads the, the sensor data. And for sensors, I'm using some linear position sensors like this, as well as some uh, accelerometers. And so what it does, it reads that data from those sensors and outputs it uh, to a SparkFund open log, which is this little guy right here, and that records that data on an SD card. It also sends that data out to a pair of XB radios. Um, I don't have one yet, but it goes plugs in right there. And so that allows me to get a real-time data stream. Um, it'll, it'll read it, feed it into my laptop. Um, so I can be you know, 300 feet away or so, and I'll, I'll get a real-time data stream while I'm having somebody else ride the bike so I can see what the bike is doing. This is important uh, for my application because I'm, I'm reading sensors at 200 times a second to see how that suspension is working um, in real time. And uh, so that's it. So you should check out the uh, link below and follow the build on Hackaday.